Hi guys, how are you doing? This is Sebastian from Tech Century, and welcome to my full review of the Lexa HR2 Professional Workflow System. So first taking a look at the price and availability, uh, all of these prices are from Amazon.com. So the HR2 Hub retails for $200 US dollars currently, the 512 gigabyte storage module for $150, the 256 gigabyte storage module for $130, and the SD card reader for $17. Now moving on to the design, we'll find a design with a mixed from glossy plastic and a leather-like finish that's similar to the Note 4 by Samsung. So I'm sure it's still plastic, but it feels and looks like leather. So that's also great to see. In my opinion, it looks very professional and it just the entire unit itself is a lot smaller than I expected, which is great that it doesn't take up too much space. Now in terms of features, we have here Thunderbolt 2 connectivity on the HR2 hub itself, which allows of course for great speeds and it also gives us the ability to daisy chain the device with other Thunderbolt devices because it has a Thunderbolt in and out on the back. And then on top of that, we also have USB 3.0 to basically fall back on if we have, for example, a laptop that doesn't support Thunderbolt, then we can still use the hub and all the modules. In addition to that, you can also use every module as a standalone module, so you don't have to purchase the hub. So if you just want a fast SD card reader that's very well built, then you can just pick up the SD card reader from the professional workflow system, for example, for 17 US dollars from Amazon. Other features include LED indicator lights on the storage modules and they basically show you the remaining capacity on these drives when you access them so you don't have to go into your system and check it there. You can just take a look at the LEDs which is very handy and in addition to that there are also a wide variety of card readers to choose from. So not only for SD cards like you see it in this video but there are also micro SD card modules, compact flash and even CFast 2.0. And all of these modules connect via USB 3.0 inside of the hub. Now in terms of use case, there are basically two different scenarios that you can use the HR2 and its modules. First off, if you just need one or two of these modules, then you can just pick them up as standalone devices and use them with a USB 3.0 cable to connect then, for example, an SD card reader and an external storage module. Or you can use it like I do and use one Thunderbolt cable and then have access to three SD card readers and a storage module with just using one cable which is of course a great solution and also very simple. And thanks to Thunderbolt and USB 3.0 you also get fast speeds for reading and writing. Now the flash modules reach speeds of 250 megabits per second for write and 350 megabits per second for read so not quite as fast as like the latest SSDs but still much faster than regular hard drives or even external USB 3.0 drives. So that's great to see. And I basically save a lot of my work files on this external 256 gigabyte module. And of course, it's also a great solution if you have multiple cameras or cards like I do, then I can just plug in my three SD cards from different cameras and have all of my footage immediately transferred over to Final Cut, for example, and I don't always need to unplug one card and then plug in another one. And this also leads us to my verdict and I can just say that I'm incredibly impressed with the HR2. It dramatically improved my import speeds of 4K footage with Final Cut Pro and I can just highly recommend the entire system and also the modules as standalone devices and I have no criticism. It's incredibly reliable in my testing period of over four weeks and in addition to that, yes, it's not cheap, but I think it's definitely worth the price. And again, if you don't want the hub, you don't have to pick it up. If you're just looking for a great SD card reader, then I can highly recommend the SD card module for 17 US dollars as well, which I think is very well priced. A big thanks also goes out to Lexa for sending out the HR2 professional workflow system for review. I really enjoyed my time with it and I'm looking forward to using it to import my footage for the next few years. So let me know what you guys think of the HR2 professional workflow system by Lexa and also the individual storage modules in the comment section down below. I'm eager to hear what you guys have to say. Like the video if you enjoyed it or dislike it if you didn't. Also make sure to subscribe to not miss any future videos here on the channel. See you next time.